first thing I did was I um, called my mom. I was in school at the time and she started crying and my whole family was crying, I was crying. It was, it was really emotional and I can't, I can't even put it into words how happy I am that I got the scholarship. Before the trip, I was in disbelief. I would say excited. Anxious. Apprehensive. And courageous. Felt eager. Blessed. Homesick. Really curious. First day of this trip, I was super excited. I, uh, I went to the airport and met everyone, and everyone was super nice. Every person in this group is amazing. There, there's so many different personalities and backgrounds, and everyone has has put a little bit into the to the melting pot. On the plane, when we were descending and we first saw the Alps, it was just this pinnacle moment of we're actually gonna go to Switzerland. Like, we will be there. Like, less than 12 hours, we will be in those mountains. We first started in Grindelwald, and that was amazing. We were, we were staying right in the mountains. And uh, one of my favorite things that we did there was a hike um, out to a lake um, called Bacalpse. And that was so much fun. We had a, such a great time and it was so beautiful up there, hiking through the mountains. What are your thoughts on snow? Uh, it's harder than I expected. Um, it's very bright. <laughs> um, So after Grindelwald, then we uh, drove out to Zermatt, which was amazing. We were staying at the base of the Matterhorn, and it actually was forecasted to rain the whole time that we were there, and we were lucky enough that it cleared up for us, and we got some amazing hikes in, and some amazing views of the Matterhorn, and it was so spectacular. Now we're in Chamonix, and it's so beautiful here. Uh, we did a hike up uh, the mountains today, and um, we're just out having a lot of fun and taking some great pictures. Everywhere we've been is, has been amazing. So the, the big thing that sets Nat Geo student expeditions apart from any other expedition trip is that we learn from National Geographic photographers and they're considered the best of the best and uh, we were lucky enough to have Robbie Schoen on our trip with us and he's an amazing photographer and, and mentor as well. Working with all the students on this trip, I've learned that uh, photography can also be fun and it was something that I really enjoyed at the very beginning, getting to grips with photography and, and making all the mistakes that you do when you're, when you're learning something new. And it's kind of taken me back to that, which was really cool as well, to realise that you, know, you, you can make mistakes and have fun and, and enjoy photography more. Every day we have new inside jokes together and, and nicknames and it's every moment here is, is a funny moment. There's no dull moments on the trip, um, especially with, with the, the group of people that we have together and the leaders that we have. It's, it's indescribable how fun it is and there can't be a price put on that. It's, it's, it's priceless. Oh jeez! Something that like really just something that just kind of brings you to life. Like 
Oh my God, I'll never forget this moment. Well, that's I probably it. can't tell the butt story from last night, <laughs> but <laughs> that's the first one that comes to mind. <laughs>